Hi, welcome. Let's build an ISO. We seem to be able on Article Linux B here to have the possibility to build your own personalized ISO. There is some information about changes. There are these guys are all minimal now. There's no full ISO anymore. And we can build our own ISO the way we see fit. But they say be aware that sometimes it's not a good timing. So if you're a builder, join us on Discord because we'll notify when you need do not or cannot build because of the fact that Python version changes, Calamaris needs to rebuild and other stuff. So we put on Discord a message, do not build, no Article Linux building for now. We've done so also in the past when we are changing from one ISO version or, or development version to the real one, the, the, the future one, right? So we need some time to make this transition. And then we say this, this thing here, coffee, no Arc Linux building. And at some point in time, we say, okay, you're good to go. Start building again. What we're gonna make now, we've made a video about this one, about this one. We're going straight down the line to the last one because the fact that this is a special one and all the others are with just one desktop. This one is a special one in the sense that it promotes OpenBox and all tiling winner and managers we have. Awesome BSPWM, i3, Herbsloft, WM, Qtile, Xmonad, and I have at least three more in my mind that will come on there. So tiling window managers, it's a specific thing. It's, it's, it's a required taste, as I say. But nevertheless, at some point, maybe you will say, well, I'll give it a try. So let's build this one. It says, get your build scripts from a certain place with git clone. And basically all you need to do is get this one. Control C. Change some files if you have to. We'll change the text, we'll change the video. Basically, you go to your desktop and you open a terminal there on the desktop. This is where we at. And Control Shift V. That's all you need to do. Result is a folder. Result is some scripts. What you need to do is go inside the installation scripts and run off one of these guys. It all depends where you live. Uh, we have people building ISOs from Africa, from uh, Russia, from all over the world. And it all depends if you have a constant internet connection, a fast internet connection, uh, you don't have a lot of bandwidth, etc. And that's where this comes in handy. Um, the 31 is actually gonna clean out a particular folder. It's gonna delete all the packages we have carefully downloaded the last 15 minutes. So 15 minutes ago, this was not there. If you run 30, it's gonna clean out the var cache pacman package folder and re-download everything. So if you say, mm, I'm low on bandwidth uh, or it's very slow today, then you better run number 40. But you need to run it at least once to be sure that you have, uh, you're using the most recent packages that are available now at this point in time. Not last week, not last month, right? Because it has versions. You need to have the last versions of each package. So if that's okay, and in my case it's 50 minutes ago, that's okay, you can run number 40, which is going to keep all of them right it's gonna run the scripts take a look at the arch iso package file and say i've got everything in my system here locally i don't need to install or i to download anything it just goes on installing stuff but some of the things will be downloaded let's have a look where can i see this probably more down there yep so these guys are all in, uh, are downloaded. Why uh, Xmonad requires Haskell, right? So all this stuff was not on my system. I have built here Arch Linux and Arch Linux D. So just i3 is, is one of the tiling window managers and all the rest, BSP, WM and all that needs to come from the internet again. So even more packages at this point in time, 1,363 to build Arch Linux, Arch Linux D and Arch Linux B extended that's the result that's all the packages i need to build uh, three isos so he's uh, being is going to install and uh, the point is article x b you need to 
note the fact that we can build it you need to you are able you don't need to you are able to build your own personalized iso the, the way you see fit if you don't like firefox just delete firefox put a hashtag in front of it you like chromium and etc etc don't like gimp and all that it's a choice and we can't make an iso that's good for all thousands of people you need to choose yourself what you like so open it up scroll down to applications that you dislike for instance Control f and then maybe firefox you dislike firefox really put a hashtag in front of it just don't delete it it's easier to do this so we still know what to do and later on when our github gets updated you compare the two, these two files what elements are new because we're making constant improvements to the system and we'll make more article Linux packages to it so here are all the stuff that's specific for your tiling window managers xmonad stuff and all that and um, we'll change these things over time you compare what you like or not like lots of stuff so basically most important thing is is just keep yourself restricted to the user applications like i don't know filezilla is it installed no it's not installed but it's your thing you want to have it okay fine you have it it's on the iso it's that easy save it build it again of course we're now building so it will not be on the iso it needs to be edited before you start to build of course let's wait everything to um, well to wait till the iso pops out and then have a look and it's done i've been working on my website so hence timeout reading password but it doesn't matter there is something in our system on your home directory you'll find a Arch Linux D out in the case if you're building an Arch Linux D ISO or an Arch Linux ISO out here, or in my case, we're building, we're building an Arch Linux B one, an Arch extended one, and that's here. Arch Linux Linux, Arch Linux B out. That's what we did. It is 1.6 gigs, so it's a very minimal because of the fact, well, it's minimal desktops, right? It's, um, it's really very uh, basic still and um, minimal resources but you check it out if you like open box and r6 tiling winner managers currently because there are um, at least three or four in the pipelines in our ideas so by the end of this year i'll probably have uh, we will have uh, 20 desktops to choose and play with all right have fun billing the iso